Hello and welcome to No Arrow. So by far we have learned a lot about AME in our previous videos. How to become an AME? What are the privileges of an AME? Apart from being an AME, there are many fields of interest related to aviation. There are various branches in the field of aeronautical engineering and aerospace engineering. As the name suggests, both of them deal with aviation science. So today in this video we are going to talk about these fields of study. We will do a comparison between these fields for a better understanding. I would suggest you to watch the video till the end and if you are new to the channel make sure to subscribe it. To begin with the definition Aerospace engineering is the primary field of engineering concerned with development of aircraft and spacecraft. It has two major and overlapping branches, aeronautical engineering and astronautical engineering. A large part of aerospace engineering consists of mechanical engineering covering a wide range of topics including computer application, structures, mathematics, physics, drafting, electricity, robotics and aeronautics. It also covers aspects of avionics engineering, but avionics deals with the electronic side of aerospace engineering. To be more precise, flight vehicles are subjected to demanding conditions such as those caused by change in atmospheric pressure and temperature, with structural loads applied upon vehicle components. Consequently, they are usually the product of various technological and engineering disciplines including aerodynamics, propulsion, avionics, material science, structural analysis, and manufacturing. The interaction between these technologies is known as aerospace engineering. Well, this field is highly specialized technological field that requires overall excellence in mathematical, calculative, and observational skills. Research in this field takes years to be completed, thus resilience and persistence are very important. Aerospace engineering may be studied at advanced diploma, bachelor's, master's and PhD levels in aerospace engineering departments at many universities. A few departments offer degrees in space-focused astronautical engineering. Some institutions differentiate between aeronautical and astronautical engineering. Now, let us take a look at aeronautical engineering. It is a well-known branch of engineering that attracts students with interest in airplanes, their mechanism and related to manufacturing of aircrafts and its parts. So, can you relate the difference between both aeronautical and aerospace engineering? Let us dig deeper. The course involves researching and construction of aircrafts within the Earth's atmosphere. It is a course of four years with 8 semesters in which students will get the academic as well as the theoretical knowledge about designing, manufacturing and testing of aircraft. Aeronautical engineering job profile is not only in the aviation industry but also in defense sector like the Air Force. They are hired by defense establishments for building and maintenance of defense aircrafts. Aeronautical engineering covers the investigation into aerodynamic elements of aircraft including behaviors and related factors such as control surfaces, lift, aerofoil and drag. The primary job of an aeronautical engineer is to devise aircraft and propulsion system, but with time, the engineer is given many more responsibilities to carry out. The aeronautical engineering scope in India is growing in the aviation sector and putting their step towards manufacturing business. Aeronautical engineering uses computer softwares like Computer Aided Design CAD to develop aircrafts or related avionics. Being a technical skill, it requires professionals with keen observation and strong calculative skills. Aerospace engineering is an ever-evolving field, adopting new technologies for further development. Here are few organizations that hire aerospace engineers in various capacities. Indian Space Research Organization ISRO, Hindustan Aeronautical Limited HAL, National Aerospace Laboratories NAL, Defense Research and Development Organization TRDO. 
So I hope that you find this video informative. Share it with your friends and colleagues who are interested in the field of aviation. And yeah, do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos.